Hello everybody, and welcome back to Pokemon Black. In the last episode, we defeated the first gym, and we got a request from uh, one of the professor's friends, Fennel, to go investigate the dream yard. So, uh, off screen, I went through and just got everyone up to level 12. So, it, so Kai and, and Barbie Wire are up to date now. So, and also we taught, we taught Barbie cut, so now we can cut down that tree. Since we dealt with the gym, like the, the trainers here, we don't have to deal with them again. Yes. Little monkey. Oh, she's Bianca. Hey, Phoenix. Are you looking for the mysterious Pokemon too? I was trying to. I'm just really, really wondering how showing dreams works. Me too. A little sound. Hey, did you hear the sound coming from the other side of the wall? Come on, let's go see. All right. Oh, look at it, it's Luna. Moon. It going away. Oh wait. We found you, Luna. Come on, come on. Make some dream mist. Huh? Who are you? What are you doing? Are you talking about us? We're Team Plasma. We battle day and night to liberate Pokemon from foolish humans. What are we doing? The Pokemon Luna and Mushimara emit a mysterious vapor called Dream Mist, which shows people's dreams. We're going to use that to make people want to release their Pokemon. We'll show them dreams and manipulate their hearts. Come on, spit out some Dream Mist. You're kicking a Pokemon to make it give off Dream Mist? That's mean! Why, you're the trainers too, right? That's right. We're Pokemon trainers too, but we're fighting for a different reason. Unlike you two, we're fighting for the freedom of Pokemon. And stunning Pokemon free means that we win battles and take Pokemon by force. So, on that note, we're going to rescue your Pokemon from you. What? Don't hurt Phoenix! Alright, first rival. Well, first, um. Shit, I forgot what you call these people. First Team Plasma thing. I believe all these people use these pet rats, so this shit should be easy. Unfortunately, we have a monkey, so. Oh, I was like, oh, that did so much damage than I thought it would. No shit, it's a fucking critical hit. <laughs> Probably trying her best though. Yeah, I should finish it. Barbie. All right, scratch one more time to do it. Oh, it's a little too late to use buying now, is it? <laughs> Alright, I think he's dead. I believe this girl also has a, a pet rat, so this should be easy. Were you not taking them seriously because they're kids? Well, whatever, I'm next. Oh, I forgot they use pearl ones too. I should probably get Barbie out of here. Um, how much is cut do? Just cut do more than scratch. Oh yeah, way more. More should do it if we don't miss. Great. Right. I'm doing 
doing too good. <laughs> Good, Barbie didn't miss. Alright, Barbie's level 13 now. Oh, Fury Swipes, okay. You're a scratch. I know we haven't been using Lick because uh, most of the early Pokemon are normal types, so... Wait, wait, but we should get a chance to use it soon. Sweet, we got like $800 between the two of them. I can't believe we lost. But we have to obtain the dream mist. <laughs> Come on, make with the dream mist. Knock it off. What are you two doing goofing off? We Team Plasma shall separate Pokemon from foolish people. If you can't fulfill your duties. This isn't Genesis when he when he was gathering trainers or against us when he's trying to control people by tricking them with speeches. Yeah. This is against us when the plan has failed and he is about to issue punishment. At this rate we'll hurry and say we're sorry so he can forgive us. It's Musharna. What was that just now? That, Pokemon, that person called Gensis appeared all over the place, and it wasn't real, right? Could that have been a dream? And that Pokemon? Oh! Oh, it's Fennel! I couldn't wait till I came over. Is that Musharna? <laughs> Did something happen? Oh, Fennel! Well, you see... Muna was here, but Team Plasma and Muna and Musharna came, and it showed us something like a dream? And then Team Plasma... I think I followed that. See, Musharna evolves from Muna, so seeing Muna in trouble, it used its power, making dreams, into reality to say Muna. Which means... Wait a minute. Is this Dream Mist? With this, I can complete my research. You two, come to my house later, okay? Phew, how random was that? Phoenix, why don't you go to Funnel's house? Me? Well, I'm gonna go look for that for the Pokemon we saw just now. Yeah, so now you will have it. Now that you can actually access some of the the Dream Yard, you should be able to get Muna if you want her. But that's not the psychic type that I want on my team. So we're gonna we're not gonna be getting her, but it's there if you guys want her. Should probably use the run button. Should probably also heal on here. Okay, and then we'll run over to Funnel's house. And get the the thing, like the game sync, but like even if I wasn't running this on a ROM, you wouldn't be able to use this now since the the Wi-Fi is disabled for DSs. Ta-da! Thanks to you, I got some Dream Mist, and now I can collect save files of various trainers. Thank you very much. With a token of appreciation, I will give you this C gear to use. The Seeger is a device related to communications such as in infrared connection or Nintendo Wi-Fi connection. Sweet! Now there won't be just a big pink block. <laughs> yeah, I guess. It's not going to do much, but... Got yeah, little hearts. You see, the Seagar was activated and that screen showed up. If you trust the question mark icon at the bottom right of the screen, you can read about the Seagear. About GameSync. I'd like to explain a little more about the system to collect trainers' profiles. You have to yeah, sure, why not? Now, GameSync will retrieve memories of sleeping Pokemon using Dream Mist. 
That's right, we can collect save files of trainers all around the world. What's more, we learned that if you use Game Sync to make a Pokemon sleep, it will have dreams. Then, when you wake up that Pokemon, that dream becomes reality in a space called Entry Link in the middle of the Unibrew region. Isn't Game Sync interesting? If you like, please send me your profile. We'll sum up the details in the PCs, so please check it when you get a chance. Oh, trainer, thank you very much for helping Fennel. This is from me. Please take it. Don't be shy. Palpad! You can register your friends with a Palpad. After you register, you can link with those friends over Nintendo Wi-Fi connections to do all sorts of fun things. You can trick Pokemon, challenge them to battles, and so on. Let me give you a quick how-to on registering your friends. You can either input your friend's friend code directly by using your pal pad, or you can use IR connection features to the C gear. Then you can register your friend. Sweet. Uh, this doesn't do anything. <laughs> no. uh, this usually tells you like who's in the area, but there's no one. I want to try this out with my own DS and see if it'll even register, just to, to, for my curiosity. There's the game sync. This is for... Let me look at this again. Wireless, that's it. Oh, I don't know what I did. Oops. Okay. It's fine. So, we're never gonna use that game sync ever again. <laughs> It crashed my game, so I just turned it off. <laughs> Alright, so I believe now that everything is done in Travis uh, Straving City, we can head over to Route 3. Let's start getting some other stuff done now. Get this guy let us through. The shiny gym badge. Getting all the gym badges to prove you have the skills enough to handle whatever comes next. Yeah, that guy would be there to stop you from heading up, so good thing that one's done. Um, I do not remember if Sharon battles us or not. Um, I believe there is a double battle right here, so I'm going to put Iggy and Kai in. I'm gonna beat up some school children. And then after we beat these girls up, we'll, we'll tackle the rest of the, the playground. Kamumi and Amy. Two poor ones. Alright, so let's have, let's have tackled this one and tackle the other one. Divide and conquer. Crowlings don't even do that much damage with scrap anyway, so no, no, um, there's really no threat here at all. Easy, see? You know, Iggy's level 13. We're good. My friend's level 13. And we're not learning focus energy, it's a waste of move. Alright. We sold this kid's lunch money. Alright. What do you say? Pokemon battling is very popular in this daycare. If you go in the playground, you'll be pressured about battling. Oh, like right now, apparently. I feel invincible when I'm surrounded by the smiles of children and Pokemon. Okay. Okay, a little bubbly. We ain't got. We can do that. I just kind of want to head over and get a new Pokemon. 
as sad as it is for it to break my little heart, I'm not going to be using Blitzel, even though I love Blitzel. <laughs> I am excited because apparently that it's coming back in the Pokemon Scarlet and Violet with the, the DLC. Which is, it's been a while since it's been in a, in a main line, so... Worth it. Oh, now we can use Bite on this thing! See? Everything has a purpose. I wish it died. Maybe we should be fine. Oh, so close to another level. It's fine. How about we switch Iggy out? For Kai? I don't want my starter getting behind. Alright, what do you have to say? Hey, trainer, have a battle with me. Alright. I believe all the elemental monkeys come into play in this little playground area, so we got the water one for right now. I do believe Simipore is the most broken out of them because of its move Scald, which gives water damage and also can burn the enemy, so it's a little annoying at times. <laughs> I don't remember if if Simi Sage is any good, but I think the worst one is probably Simi Seer. And that's the one I have. <laughs> I should probably heal my Pokemon real quick. Potion. All better, see? Oops, okay. Hopefully this one isn't the grass one. <laughs> Preschooler Wendy. Hands here, okay. See, we'll fucking one-shot this one, it's fine. And then we'll put, um, we'll put Barbie in the front. To deal with the hand stage. Why did the thing not die? I mean, it should have. Well, now it's dead. Almost another level, okay. Forty dollars? Your mother needs to give you more lunch money, kid. Alright, and let's put Barbie in the front to do with the pants sage. Take this, hyper beam! Preschooler Tooley. Who the fuck names are kids Tooley? Man, your ki your parents must have really hated you. Oh, you keep spamming and incinerate until this thing goes down. I should teach anyone to work up. Maybe I should put it on Kai. Because it does attack and special. I can get rid of Tail Whip. That might actually be a good investment. You know what? Fuck it. I'll do that. Alright. Where is the TM's work up? Use. I think any Pokemon can learn this, so. Should be fine. And Kai can't learn it. Oh! He's got an item! What do you got, boy? And take. Oh, a full heal. That's nice. Uh, also, best feature of this game, we can go up and down the slide. 
chest feature. Alright, I think that's done with everything. Also, the the daycare is over here as well. Oh, that is not good. Um, okay. Sometimes they let us play with Pokemon. So, the daycare is right here. So you can start breeding Pokemon. I believe you can just do one for right now. So it will gain levels. It gave one XP for every step that you take. And it will automatically just like choose moves to delete. So be a little bit careful with that one. But so if you are doing like a Nuzlocke and you want to like s just throw a Pokemon in there to get XP, it's probably like the best way. I'll probably start doing that. I knew it. I should have fucking. I should have healed. <laughs> we both have trio beds, so let's see which one of us is stronger. Well, I'm almost dying, Sharon. <laughs> Shit, I knew I should have healed. <laughs> We still have... We still have pants here in the front. Okay, we're, we're fine. Um, Alright, incinerate. Probably has a berry on it. Yeah, I knew it. Gross. Attack rows, that's not good. Oh, and special attack rows too. <laughs> that's a good move as usual. Yeah, I just like spamming moves. It's my thing. That's good. Oh wait, that was not good. That was us. That was us. I got hit by a critical hit. <laughs> Is one berry, so. No, it did not. Okay. Let's try our new move. Um, Fury Swipes. And it only did twice. Okay. What? Okay, that's not, that's not fair. Calling hacks. What? That shit's stupid. Oh, great, it got broke. That shit sucks. Alright, we're switching out pants here. He sucks. Bring Iggy out. Iggy's almost close to the level anyway, so. Do him some good. Eh, yeah, we're the tackler, but it's okay, it's okay. Just tackle it, it should go down. How are we slower than a porn line? You don't even have negative speed. Killed the damn cat. Finally. Alright, Nick's level 14 now. He's a little puppy. Why do you keep beating me? We have the same number of gym badges. We should be equals. Yeah, we should, but I have Riz and you don't. Out of the way! What was that about? Yanko? Why are you running? Hey, where are those two people head? That way, but... Why are you running now? Oh, seriously, they ran so fast. Miss? Oh, my Pokemon. It'll be okay. It'll be okay, don't cry. 
Bianca, really, why are you running? <laughs> you have to hear this. Those people sold this girl Pokemon. We should have spoken up sooner. Phoenix, we'll head we're going ahead and get that Pokemon back. Bianca, please stay here on the girl's side. Oh, you didn't heal my Pokemon? What a dickhead. Alright. Well, I'll do it myself then. Fucking ass. Yeah, that should be fine. I should be kind of in the front now. Oh, shit. Wrong button. There we go. And let's put it way right. It's like... Probably have like six. Let me get this Pokeball real quick. Super Potion. Good find for early on. Alright. What's up, Sharon? You're right inside here. Thanks, sure you should be fine. You ready to go inside? Yeah, I guess. Alright, let's go. Phoenix. Those bothersome bunch don't seem to listen to reason. That child can't use the Pokemon to its full potential. Does that make doesn't that make the Pokemon sad? It's the same thing for all your Pokemon, so hand them over to us now. Better yet, we'll just take them. I don't wanna work with Sharon on this one. Snob. <laughs> oh, I guess I just, just battled them one by one. Okay. That's fine. It's Pet Rat. In the cave. Alright, Water Gun should just do this. Critical hit, that's pretty good. Tackle. They didn't use the tech, that's awesome. Alright. That was easy. Good job. Ty's level 14 now. Only that much money? You guys need to ask for a bigger salary. What? How can we lose when we have the right on our side? Not bad, Phoenix. Okay, go return the girl- that Pokemon to the girl. You don't need to return it. How troublesome. Not only did you fail to understand, but you actually got her away to boot. There's two of you and two of us. We'll show you our combined power and teach you that we are right. So, there's more of them. Still, why are Pokemon robbers acting so self-righteous? Phoenix, these we've been friends our whole lives. We got each other's backs when it when it counts. Let's show them how it's done. Okay, now it's a double battle. I remember there being a double battle in this cave. Because now it is. Front and a grunt. And two pet rats. This should be easy. One down at least. He's always smart enough to go for the, the one that's dying. So. Oh, sweet critical hit! Good job, Kai. You stood there. What did we lose? I can't believe that Team Plasma lost to such kids. to liberate Pokemon from foolish people, we will take their Pokemon. Whatever, what a waste of time. God, what reason could we... What reason could possibly justify stealing Pokemon from people? Pokemon trainers like you are making Pokemon suffer. What do you mean? Trainers are making Pokemon suffer? I don't get that at all. We'll get 
protect that Pokemon. Just be aware of how this Pokemon suffers from being used by people. Someday your eyes will open to your own compli- I can't read that. <laughs> trainers bring out their Pokemon strength. Pokemon believe in their trainers and respond to that. I don't understand about what makes Pokemon suffer. Okay, Phoenix. I'll return to Pokemon. Alright, bye! I'm gonna get my new Pokemon here. <laughs> Ooh! Shit! Alright. Oh, we got it right away! So this is what I wanted it to join us now. Um, I want to do something different. So I've always had a, a si Sigilus, I believe that's how you pronounce it. It's the, the really cool art Pokemon, the desert. Um, I always use that for my runs. So why not use a different Psychic Flying type that I think is pretty cool. So might as well just like, try this one out for a go. Um, let's use the Death Ball. It'll look nice on it since it's found in caves anyway. And it's a girl. I don't know what we're gonna name her though. Right we'll read the description to see if we can get a, a good idea for a nickname. The habitat is dark forests and caves and emanates ultrasonic waves from its nose to learn about its surroundings. It's the bat. Now what nickname should I give you? Absolutely we're gonna get a nickname. Hmm. The bat. Alright, we're calling it Rouge. Uh, how do you spell that? <laughs> I might have to ask Google real quick. <laughs> Hold on, let me see. Rouge the bat. Okay. Okay. Wait. No, no, no. I don't want... Stop. Stop. <laughs> I just want to know how to spell it. Okay. R. Uh, lowercase. U. Um. G. Perfect. Fitting. We get... Oh, yeah. We gotta check its stuff now. Wellspring Cave. It has a gentle nature. And that means plus special defense minus defense. That's okay. That's okay. That's alright. And it can't hold any items. It's okay. And it's not gonna grow out of it. <laughs> oh yeah, we gotta get that item. This is also a good type, it's just I don't have anyone to trade with with this ROM, so... But, very good rock type. We should probably put someone else in the front now. Um, maybe I can try catching if while while going through this cave. Maybe I can try catching a different Wubat. That can't be its only ability, right? <laughs> uh, hopefully not. That would suck. Well, there's another one. We'll try that one. What abilities can you have? Unaware's the other one. So if this one has unaware. I'll take it. Ignores the opposing Pokemon's stat changes. Yeah, that's real good. Why'd they give this thing klutz? <laughs> the only thing that would suck is that this thing's a boy, so... We could, we could still call it Rouge if we want. <laughs>
Wait, hold on. I got a big brain. Uh, cool bat names. Cosmo? Alright, hell yeah. Cosmo it is. Please don't have klutz, that would suck. As a gentle nature and unaware. Alright, we're keeping Cosmo. <laughs> that sucks for Rouge, but... Usually, usually I do first time first serve with these things, but like, Klutz sucks. I would say it's only really good in like, competitive. But like, like in some cases where like, this thing might learn like... I don't remember the name of the move that like, switches around like, what the user's holding. So like, you can give them like, a poison thing or like, a sticky barb or something or whatnot. Like, that can be good. But not when I'm trying to do the gym leaders. <laughs> like, the, the elite form shit. I need to get out of this cave. I'm dying right now. And we got Thief. That's good. Dark attack. Uh, it steals the opponent's held moves. But it only really lets them steal it if you're not holding anything. And we're just gonna run away. We don't, <laughs> we don't have the manpower for this shit. Alright. I was one step away from the damn cave! Let me leave! <laughs> Get out of here. What do you mean you can't get away? It's easy. Just leave. Good. Alright. We almost died, but it's okay. Alright. <laughs> Should I? I'm, I'm gonna end the episode soon. I just want to release Rouge into the wild. No, 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 I don't wanna- I don't wanna talk to you guys. Phoenix, thank you so much. The two of you got back your Pokemon. I'm lucky to have friends like you. Thank you, miss. Please take this as a thank you present. Oh, we got heal balls. That's nice. One use only of as soon as you catch a Pokemon, I'll be back to full health and no stats. No, uh... What do you call them? Like, no, like, paralysis or burns or shit. Oh, those are heal balls. They completely healed the captured Pokemon on the spot. How sweet of you. I'm going to see this girl on her way, so see you later. Phoenix, bye bye. Bye. All right. I know there's Charons down there. He's gonna explain dark grass. So I think I can access a PC in the daycare. So then we have Cosmo. That'll be our official second party member? Because I, I know I'm not going to keep Iggy or uh, Barbie on my team, so they're just going to be like helpers and like HM slaves. <laughs> so. But we'll, we'll fill it up as we go. We'll, we'll find some more people to put on our team. I know of a couple that I'm thinking of putting on as well, so should be fun. So I think that's gonna do it. Um, we did a lot. We dealt with Team Plasma. We saved uh, Amuna. My game crashed, and we caught a new game. We caught a new uh, party member. So I, I say that's a success for like one episode. So in the next one, we'll be heading down Route 3, seeing what Charon's doing, and heading down to the next city. 
and hopefully exploring that place a little bit. So thank you guys so much for watching and I hope I'll uh, see you guys next time.